Hello everyone, Tina Spalding, Trance Channel here. Uh, I've been called to do a video about the war that is brewing or has just started in the Ukraine. I have my trusty assistant here. We're in a hotel room right now, uh, traveling back to Canada from Sedona. So I'm in California right now and uh, the urge to do a video about this came up. So I'm gonna do that. Before I start, I do just wanna let you know that uh, Sunday, which is tomorrow, uh, February 27th uh, at sometime, <laughs> it's either 12 or 1 o'clock, it's in the link uh, description below this video, the details will be there. Uh, we, are do we are doing a one hour Q&A with Jesus and Ananda uh, for, public, for the public. So um, if you're seeing this video as soon as it's uploaded, which will be tonight, Saturday evening, do consider joining us tomorrow. Uh, these hour-long, intense Q&A sessions are very different than their normal videos and there's a lot of information that comes your way and you have to remember that it is uncensored when you join us on a private uh, um, event like that. It is $22 US for non-members and if you are a member, make sure that you um, click the link within our community and not this public one because the public one will charge you full price. So for those of you that have been curious about our community, this might be a great time to join and give us a month trial and uh, then you get access to 140 or so live streams where we do these Q&As and a lot of information is transmitted. So do consider joining us even if you come for a month and enjoy all of the videos for a month, you can unsubscribe if you don't enjoy the community and all the things we have to offer. So with that, I will stop talking as Tina and we'll see what Jesus has to say about the war in the Ukraine. <clears throat> You are blessed beings indeed. I am that one that you know as Jesus. Your egos love war. And this is something that your uh, global orchestrators, we all call them, uh, they know this. They have been feeding your ego fear and uh, judgment and separation for the last few years nonstop. And those of you that are buying into this next version of the ego's favorite food, we will say it is time to stop. It is time to stop. Do not buy into it. What is coming up for all of you is the frequency of fear and death and separation. And that is why it feels so bad. You have a guidance system that is aligned with love and truth. You were not sent down here into separation by yourselves without any guidance. You have a God-given divine guidance system that is aligned with love and truth. And whenever you're in alignment with that truth and love, you will feel good. Whenever you are distracted from it, whenever you fall in the ditch next to the road on which you should be walking, you will feel horrible and you will feel fear and you will feel concern and you will feel anger and you will feel judgment and hate. And this is what is being fed to you once again through your media systems. We want you to understand that there is nothing, nothing accidental about the fact that this is occurring as your COVID terror is ending. There is nothing accidental about it. It is an orchestration and it is a very big orchestration. And we want you to understand that these orchestrations are not fake. They are not harmless. There are real people having real consequences of these global machinations. And that is not to say that you should not care about those who are the innocent bystanders, the collateral damage, as your society likes to call it. But the truth of the matter is, is if you are being sucked down into fear and judgment and anger because of the images you are watching fed to you by a media that wants you afraid, then you are being foolish. You are being naive. And after this last two years, we say, come on now, it is time for you to really understand that this endless barrage of fear and terror is so clearly orchestrated. 
that there is a part of you that is shut down from your own native intelligence if you are still falling for it. Yes, it's a different form, but the form is always deceptive. This is the illusion of this place, the Maya of this place. You have to go to the frequency of the images that you are seeing. The frequency of the images that you are seeing now are the same frequency of the images that you saw in hospitals and ventilators and people keeling over from some fabricated disease. It is the same frequency. The form is what is deceiving you. You think this is a new event. You think this is a random occurrence. It is not. It is all orchestrated. And there are billions of people now who are falling for, for the next scam. As Course in Miracles students, it is so important for you to rise above the battleground. And in this case, it is literal. Rise above the battleground and look at the pattern of your society. What is it showing you? It is showing you nothing but hatred and fear and death. Hatred and fear and death are the ego's way of being here. It is its nature. But what has happened in your society is that the ruling elite have figured this out long ago. They've been doing this for a very, very long time. I came onto the earth plane 2,000 years ago, and it was exactly the same, fear and intimidation, threat of death. That is how they control people. But if you rise above the battleground, if you follow your guidance system and only pursue and research and observe and engage with that which makes you feel happy and loved and creative and curious, then you will be a true revolutionary. You are not a revolutionary if you are buying this story. You are not a revolutionary if you're buying this story. You are following their directive if you buy this story. So we want every single one of you, every single one of you who's watching this. Now you have clicked on a Channeling Jesus video. That means you have some curiosity. That means you have some courage. It means that you want to have some different source of information. And so here you are watching this video. We challenge you, we challenge all of you who are watching this to share this video because this is the information that people need to have. They need to have this information because they are getting constant barrages of other information that are lying to them. And the way to counter hypnotic lies is to share the truth. And the truth of this is you are being played and your fear of death is being taken advantage of. And your fear of death is your ego. Your fear of death is your ego. Your ego is that part of you that has taken into itself every fearful, separated, sick idea that you have ever encountered and you have allowed it to live in your minds. And it is part of this place. The ego's mindset is part of this place. And as you experience this place, you have to come to the point where you realize that if you keep looking at the ego's poop, if you keep looking at the ego's poop, you feel bad. This is the time now to say, I am turning this off. I am turning my ego's desire for war off. And this is the most powerful thing we want to say to you. If you are watching the war, if you are watching the news, if you are lapping it up, it is your ego that is being strengthened by this, these images and this story. And you will suffer for it by losing your connection to source. Not truly, you never lose your connection to source truly, but your awareness of that connection will become lessened. So for every one of you that tuned into this session because you wanted to find out about the war, we want you to get this piece of information. The war is the distraction. The war is the disease and your desire, your desire to watch the war is your ego being strengthened. And it is your ego being strengthened that the global orchestrators of this increasingly chaotic world that you are a part of 
know that you have a part of you that wants to watch the war. They know that you have a part of you that believes in death. They know that you have a part of you that will not turn it off. And we challenge you, first of all, to share this video and then to turn off your televisions, to turn off the videos that are showing you the war, to delete the images from your social media stream and get outside and go for a walk with your dog. Get outside and start planting your garden for the spring. Get outside and paint a picture. Get outside and go for a run. Turn it off and embellish the life that you are creating right now by what you are focusing on. All of you that are here because you are curious about the war are focusing on war. And so what will happen? War. You, are, you have been focusing on sicknesses, sickness and what is happening? You are getting sicker. We want you to understand that until you command your mind to look at what is good, to look at what is true, to look at what is loving, you will be played by these global leaders. You are, they all are playing in the sand, same sandbox, just as when you see your children playing in the sandbox and one is the good guy and one is the bad guy, one is the cowboy and one is the Indian, one is the stormtrooper and the other one is the Star Wars hero, what are they truly? They know and love each other. They are playing at war. This is what your global leaders are doing. They know and love each other and they are playing at war. It is not real. Yes, it is a real consequence to the innocent bystanders on the ground, but we want you to understand that it is their terror, their fear that you are consuming and it will lower your frequency and you will become less influential. That is our message for you today. Stop buying into the endless fear mongering that your society is feeding you. It is feeding you poison, it is feeding you hatred, it is feeding you death. And if you consume it and you get all sympathetic and feeling down, you are giving them exactly what they want, which is your frequency being lowered. You now are less influential and that's exactly what they want. Become the powerhouse connected to source that you are destined to be. This is what the ascension is about. It is about you understanding your own power and influence. It is about you mastering your own mind. They are mastering your minds for you if you are believing this next debacle. I am that one that you know as Jesus and I will speak to you again soon. Thank you, Jesus. Um, I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it. I can see what they are doing. This, uh, the, the, um, the sickness is, is dissipating and the fear is dissipating and they have had to replace it with something else. I don't buy it. So check out the link below for our hour long Q and A tomorrow, February 27th. This is, uh, not something that we've advertised much, but please do consider joining us. It will be well worth it, and we will get some get to some good sub good juicy subjects without censorship. Thank you for joining me to watch this video. Please share it as Jesus has asked, so that other people can get this information. Thank you. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.